Um, can I draw on your face? Uh, I don't know yet, but it'll, it'll be something good, I promise. Really? Okay. Hmm. What should I draw? Hmm. I want to do something that brings out your cheekbones. Because your cheekbones are so good. Yeah. <laughs> They're really not like anyone else's cheekbones, I don't think. Except for maybe this one person who has similar cheekbones. I think they're the only person whose cheekbones kind of remind me of yours. Oh, um, yeah, I'm gonna use eyeliner because that way you can wash it off. It's really old though. It's like, I think it's like six years old. So it might have some bacteria, but I'm not putting it in your eyes, so I think it's okay. Um, I kept, I keep it for faces because, um, I don't want to use it on people's eyes because of the bacteria but I think it's okay to use on people's faces. Can I start? Okay, let's see. Um, so I'm just gonna start right there. probably pull your skin a little bit so that I can get a smoother surface, okay? Right there. It's gonna be mostly on this cheek, but there's gonna be some over here, okay? Does that work for you? Okay. Um... I want you to know that I'm sure you're gonna get better at Tetris over time. We just have to keep playing it together, and then I think eventually you'll be good competition for me. Okay? It's okay not to win, because, like, I wouldn't win against me whenever I first started either. Because I, I've played a lot of Tetris, and I'm really, I'm really good at it now. Hey, stay still, please. And don't furrow your brow. Undo that. Undo your furrowed brow. You're gonna get wrinkles. I'm gonna get wrinkles too, but at least my wrinkles aren't gonna look angry. Okay. I'm not going to tell you what it is yet. <laughs> nope. Maybe I'll tell you once I'm done on this side. Um, the first time I played Tetris was in an airport. It was, it was on like a little, it was, it was a Tetris machine. All it did was Tetris. Tetris was the only game that I had and, um, I think I got it at the airport and I just played Tetris for, uh, the 
the whole vacation that we were going on because I didn't really want to go to the beach. So in the airport, I got the Tetris thing and then I just played that. I like how um, on the side of your face over here, The way that your jaw meets your ear is really beautiful. I mean, it's not just you. I think everyone's jaw meets their ear like this, but it's one of my favorite parts of faces. On this side, it does it too. Okay. There you go. Alright, I'm gonna redo that part because I don't want it to look messed up. I don't want it to look messed up. So I'm gonna redo this part right there. Stay still, okay? people's faces too often. It's more of like a special occasion sort of thing, I think. Like, um, I'm gonna check to make sure it looks okay on this side. Uh, yeah. Can you turn your face a little bit? Okay. Yeah, I think that looks good. Um, Yeah, it's like a special occasion sort of thing because, like, people don't usually want to have their faces, like, with stuff on it, like, in normal life, so it has to be special because otherwise it would be too obnoxious, um, but I do like doing it. I like drawing on people's faces because it's like touching their faces, except, well, it's more satisfying in some ways and less satisfying in others. It's more satisfying because I get to leave my mark. I feel like I claim you. <laughs> but it's less satisfying because I don't really get to touch it as much. You know? I don't get to feel all of the face. But that's okay. Um, because I'll get to touch your face other times. Okay, I'm gonna color this part in now. I'm gonna color it in. Color, 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 color. Um... What's your favorite animal? Um... No, no. Like, I don't care what, what you would be if you were an animal. Um, I mean, you can answer that if you want, but like, that's not what I'm asking. I want to know what your favorite one is. Hmm... Yeah, that's not what I'm drawing, but that's okay. I have an idea. Because I just finished this side, and now I'm going to do this side. I want to tell you what I'm drawing. I want to tell you what I'm drawing. But, it's still a secret. I'm going to shut both of your ears, and then I'm going to say it out loud. And if you can hear it, then you'll know. And if you can't hear it, then you don't know. Okay. 
Okay, I'm gonna shut your ears now. Did you hear it that time? Okay, I'm gonna try doing it just on one side um, and maybe you'll be able to hear it, but maybe you won't, okay? Okay, I'm gonna try the other side. hear it? <laughs> I'm drawing a unicorn with its head cut off. <laughs> yeah. No, I think it'll be really good. No, it's not a horse. Well, because it has a horn. No, I'm not- I'm not drawing the horn, but it still has one. Its head is just cut off, but it still has a horn. It's just not there. It's a unicorn. It's not a horse. Stay still. Yeah, on this side is like the back of the horse, and then on this side is like the chest and the front, and the lack of head. Yeah, I guess it's also cut in half. And headless. I think the front of the unicorn is my favorite part. Unicorns are very different from horses, though, um, for all kinds of reasons. They. I messed up a little bit. Unicorns are smaller than horses. They're skinnier, kind of bonier, not as muscly. They have longer legs. They're not for riding. You don't ride a unicorn. And they shouldn't pull anything like a cart. They're not as, um, Horses are like Neanderthals as unicorns, as humans are to unicorns. And this unicorn doesn't have a head. But I think you could tell it's a unicorn even without its head. Or it would be like... I don't know. Some kind of other... Uh... Ungulate. Almost more like a goat, really, than a horse. Like a tall, muscular goat. Where'd my cap go? I think it's a unicorn without a head. 
I think it looks great. Yeah, it's like, um, it goes all the way from right here, all the way to your ears, all the way to your ears, all the way to your ears. And it definitely accentuates your cheekbones, which honestly was the whole goal, because your cheekbones are just Beautiful. Um, anyway, do you, uh, do you want to go to Safeway and get snacks and play Tetris? No. Please don't wash it off. I mean, you can if you want to, but please don't. Okay. <laughs> yes, let's go to Safeway.